Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome once again to Storytime with Henry. Tonight will be no ordinary night because we will be celebrating our two subscriber milestone with a special. For this special, I thought it would be appropriate to read an audience request and one of my personal favorites from my preschool year, if you give a moose a muffin, replete with social and cultural implications. I hope you'll stay tuned because you're in for a real treat. If you give a moose a muffin, authored by Laura Jaffe Numera and illustrated by Felicia Bond. If you give a moose a muffin. This book was dedicated to Alice and Emily, the two best sisters anyone could possibly want. Now, this was the author's dedication. The illustrator dedicates this book to Antony, Nahum, Jennifer, Santos, Brian, and Crystal. If you give a moose a muffin, he'll want some jam to go with it. So you'll bring out some of your mother's homemade blackberry jam. When he's finished eating the muffin, he'll want another, and another, and another. And when they're all gone, he'll ask you to make more. You'll have to go to the store to get some muffin mix. He'll want to go with you. When he opens the door and feels how chilly it is, he'll ask to borrow the sweater. When he puts the sweater on, he'll notice one of the buttons is loose. He'll ask for a needle and thread. He'll start sewing. The button will remind him of the puppets his grandmother used to make. So he'll ask for some old socks. He'll make sock puppets. When they're done, he'll want to put on a puppet show. He'll need some cardboard and paints. Then, he'll ask you to help make the scenery. When the scenery is finished, he'll get behind the couch, but his antlers will stick out. So he'll ask for something to cover them up. He'll bring him a sheet from your bed. When he sees the sheet, he'll remember he wants to be a ghost for Halloween. He'll try it on and shout, Boo! It'll scare him so much, he'll knock over the paints. So he'll use the sheet to clean up the mess. Then he'll ask for some soap to wash it out. He'll probably want to hang the sheet up to dry. He'll go outside and put it on the clothesline. When he's out in the yard, he'll see your mother's blackberry bushes. Seeing the blackberries will remind him of a jam. He'll probably ask you for some. And chances are, if you give him the jam, he'll want a muffin to go with it. Thanks for watching. If you like what you saw, be sure to give a like and subscribe. And remember, there's nothing more attractive than reading a book.